Oh, what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary. But the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing round the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. There's the whistle. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Roberto Firmino. Pretty much the ultimate team player, Peter, in that he gives his teammates a real lift and makes everyone feel better he can drop deep to pick up the ball and create chances for others or drift wide to drag defenders out of position and that versatility makes him really hard to defend against he's also full of running and he's extremely effective in that first line of defense hard to disagree with that he's gone for it it's in it's hardly a surprise is it that's what we're here for a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Liverpool are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. So, a breakthrough already. Berati tries lifting it over. He's gone for it! Really well taken goal. Was there ever any doubt? Well, he always had the measure of the keeper there. Such confidence and composure. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Mane goes up and over. Marco Verratti.
Mbappe really got caught in a trap there and he just couldn't get out. Mane, foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. He's trying to... It's hit the crossbar! That is gorgeous! That is a gem! An absolute gem! Into the lead once more! And he's produced a beauty. Liverpool get themselves into the lead. Berati tries to stroke it through. Midway through the first period, and it's looking quite a game here. Konate. Alisson gets it upfield. In with the challenge. Marquinhos goes looking. And he just whacks it away. And it's Bernat. Vinaldum. Vinaldum! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. kick it's got through and Neymar tries a shot Robertson gets it away. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Hey. Liverpool have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Coman, Firmino, oh, and the shot! Wijnaldum is there, and he has a pop! Oh, taken with style! Two up, and threatening to pull clear! Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Liverpool take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win.
Well, that goal should be a big game changer. It's certainly been a big mood changer. And that's sprayed out wide. Coma. Oh, they could break here. Ferrati gets into the right position to intercept. And it's Ferrati. Di Maria. Out of play for a goal kick. Hoists it high. Allison catches it safely. Robertson. Tries to get it forward quickly. The referee's awarded a free kick. Time whistle goes. <laughs> so off we go once more. Look, before they might get too carried away with thoughts of getting back into the game, they can't afford to slip up and concede another. The next goal becomes crucial. Forward it goes. Di Maria plays it out to the flank. Mbappe goes for goal! Oh, that was no routine save. Neymar simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. can get it clear. It's a throw. Renato Sanchez gets good distance on it. Back into the middle. Oh, really tidy interchange. Can he shoot? Marquinhos. And here's Neymar. Mane set up one goal so far. Mbappe. Di Maria. And a header! Sticks it away! Back within one. They have them in their sights again. What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. <laughs> Liverpool are making a change now. Coleman is being withdrawn here, but he certainly made his mark. Well, has he done enough since his goal? Is the feeling that he's lost his appetite for another? It's difficult to be sure exactly what the thinking is, but his race has certainly run now. We have got ourselves a game here. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. Markov, it's Verratti! And for a moment, time stood still. Bernat. And it's Neymar. Mbappe. Caught offside that time. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. 
Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Di Maria battles to win it back. Mbappe. Neymar gets on the end of it. Has a pop! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Robertson. Well, the pressure is relentless. It's a very, very high press. Yeah, because it's all about winning the ball back at the earliest opportunity. A trigger by one player for the others to follow and designed to force opposition mistakes. Paris Saint-Germain are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Konate drives it forward, hoists it forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And here's Ramos. And it's been taken straight back. Shapes to shoot. Chance again. No. Paris Saint Germain really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Mane. And it's Firmino. Now it's Shakiri. Marquinhos. And that's that. A oh, fine advertisement for attacking football. A really entertaining game. So many talking points. In a way, a shame anybody had to lose. How do you look back on the game then, Jim?